We're going to the next tutorial. I'm sorry, uh, I learned Unreal Engine a little bit and I can't just make the new tutorial. So anyways, today we are doing a look at rotation uh, using a cube, I think, yeah. So let's get started. So first thing you want to do is uh, make an actor called I don't know, name it like you want. I, I just call just cube. <clears throat> so you want to open it up and you want to add a cube. And you want to add arrow in this cube so you can see what face he's looking at, right? Directly, right? So. And you want to add a box collision. Box collision make uh, 100 and uh, make uh, 500, 500 and 300. So if you're dragging this into level, a little bit higher. So now you can see the thing. So next thing you want to delete only two of them because we need a tick so first thing you want to do is uh, add even overlap begin overlap you want to cast to whatever character you have correctly uh, you want to make a new variable called in uh, in range and you wanna set this on true you wanna copy and you wanna do the same thing and but end overlap okay you have this right now so name it set up or something I don't know. so now you want to take the stick add a branch you're gonna check it's this each player is inside this collision box if it's true you want to uh, find look at rotation so this is the math thing. So the start is the basic. Uh, so you want to get a cube and get world location. So he's only facing that location. What uh, he is uh, last position, I think. So now you want to get player spawn or uh, character because they are both spawn section. So you want to get location. You want to get a mesh. You want to so. So you want to macro this, look at rota rotation using col uh. So now you have a uh, output here and uh, you want to put this thing as well in here because this is the target so so now you have this you want to drag out on target set world rotation if it's true 
we're gonna set the this Q vector rotation and uh, we're gonna let me change this so now you wanna put this here and it's basically all you need to do now if you play you see I have my cube over there now he's facing me actually he fa he's facing mesh and let me so okay so if you are play starting playing you can't see the arrow facing me so you just have to hide in game just untick that and you will see the magic and now he will facing you after you after oh okay after you are in out in the in out collision you just uh but i can't see it oh okay, okay here You see now he's facing you right now he's facing you like any any long way you go but uh, that's why because we uh, forgot to uncheck this if now we are doing this you are in collision he's gonna he's gonna he's gonna look at you and now if you are like going like inside this like out of the collision you you see he will last position is like that how we fix that it's easy, really simple so we just want to copy this and uh, all you need to do because um, if you're out the, out of collision his last position is uh, he last new position is uh, zero 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 it means the same position what this is here if you see it's zero 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 so to, you see it's now facing you i'm going out and it's that position like that simple but if you want to like yeah you can like customize it if you put a 180 here and you have to put a 180 in here as well now if you go out you see the same location so yeah so that's it for this today's tutorial and i hope we will see you soon if you have any uh, tutorial ideas just hit me up with a comment i will make my best to make make the tutorial and help you out so yeah that's it for this tutorial and we will see you in another one